We are a pretty unusual couple, I guess, because I throw knives on my wife. Do you remember the craziest knife throwing act in AGT history, Deadly Games? The showman himself, Alfredo Silva, is back on AGT Extreme and has accomplished a lot to get where he is now. Alfredo Silva, then and now, that's what's hot. Hey guys, it's Corey, and today I want to talk about one of the biggest names in the danger category of the Got Talent franchise, Deadly Games. Today I'll mostly be talking about the three-time Golden Buzzer champion, Alfredo Silva. Alfredo is a sixth generation performer. He studied magic, juggling, and even Globe of Death, which we'll talk about later. He started throwing knives at 12 years old at his family circus in Brazil. In modern day, he creates and designs his own weapons. In 2016, Alfredo Silva took to the America's Got Talent stage for the first time with his wife, Anna, as the danger duo Deadly Games. Before their time on stage, the duo had been married for two years. His wife at the time is a dancer and choreographer. She agreed to be a part of Alfredo's knife throwing act to combine both of their passions. Their act was portrayed as a mix of both romance and fear. Their America's Got Talent audition consisted of Alfredo throwing knives in the direction of his wife. With each of her moves, the knives would land on the wall behind her. Their act was honestly terrifying, but it never got old. Unfortunately, they were eliminated in the semifinals. Deadly Games returned to America's Got Talent in 2019 for AGT The Champions. The couple returned to the stage with another knife throwing act, but this time it was way bigger. Anna stood in front of a rotating target while Alfredo threw knives at her. Heidi Klum was amazed by their performance and gave them her golden buzzer. In the finale, Deadly Games once again showed off Anna's knife dodging skills, but this time with a twist. Their act ended with Alfredo shooting an apple off of Anna's head. I'm sorry, what? That was probably one of the most terrifying acts I've ever seen. Unfortunately, Deadly Games did not make it past the top five and they were eliminated instead of Shin Lim. Soon after the show, Alfredo and Anna revealed that they had ended both their personal and professional relationship. While Anna decided to pursue modeling, Alfredo decided to continue Deadly Games with his new partner, Alexandra Kiowicz. Before Deadly Games, Alexandra was known as the eighth season winner of Poland's Got Talent for her aerial art. They met performing in the same show in Sydney, Australia. So I was performing my aerial act, Alfredo at the time was performing his knife throwing act, and... Here we are. This is how we met. <laughs> in 2022, they're celebrating their fourth anniversary together as a couple, and are currently engaged. In 2019, they competed in the World's Got Talent special held in China. They were the judges' choice winner, but ended up withdrawing from the competition. Later in 2019, they competed on Britain's Got Talent The Champions, but were eliminated in the preliminaries. The duo created a new act for this competition. Instead of Alfredo throwing knives at his fiance, she would be suspended in the air as well. This definitely added a new level to their already terrifying act. Oh, oh, oh that was close. During 2020, Deadly Games was unemployed for a while due to the Las Vegas Strip being closed. So for the time being, the duo practiced performing in their apartment. They shared videos of them at home together during this time, including one that features Alexandra throwing knives at Alfredo. Yeah, you heard that one, right? At the time of the video, Alfredo said that Alexandra had been practicing the skill. Are we gonna see them switch spots at some point? Later that year, Alfredo returned to the AGT stage to perform with his brother, Alan, in the finale. Instead of Alfredo's fiance, he was instead throwing knives and shooting arrows at his brother, who was suspended from aerial silks. In 2021, Deadly Games returned to the America's Got Talent stage to perform with Duo Transcend. Now, although many may think this was Alfredo's first AGT performance with his new partner, it wasn't. They were a guest performance in AGT in season 14. After Deadly Games' 2021 performance, they joined the America's Got Talent Las Vegas live show. Later in 
2021 Deadly Games auditioned for Slovakia's Got Talent and earned a golden buzzer there as well. Now we're going to pause here because I have to say, Deadly Games was amazing back in the day with Alfredo and Anna. But let me just say here, their audition for Slovakia's Got Talent? Holy sh**! Alexandra brings a lot of personality into their act. She has so much talent herself. I hate to say this, but I think the new act might be better than the original. Left. Stop. Down. Stop. Okay. In 2022, Alfredo is living out his family legacy as a third generation cage rider. He is now competing in the new series, AGT Extreme, with fellow riders Gary Laurent and John Stotts, as well as two BMX riders, Colby and Marco. The cage riders took to the giant stage to show off what they really can do without any restrictions. Within the series, he shared that Globe of Death was his first love with Danger Axe. His best friends are inside of the cage with him and they've been riding together for several years. His grandfather and father used to perform Globe of Death together, so he's hoping to make them proud in the new competition. My heart and my mind is into this because of my grandfather that passed a few years ago, and I'm sure he's watching me right now. I want to make him proud. Terry Crews gave Alfredo his third golden buzzer in AGT Extreme. In Alfredo's Instagram post about the series, he shared that Terry is one of his idols and also one of the nicest people he's ever met. He's very uh, active on social media, so he liked my post, he comments on my post, Terry Crews, Thumbs up, one of the most um, nicest guy I ever met. Their audition was both terrifying and extreme, and I couldn't look away. I can't wait to see them continue on in the competition and possibly bring home the title of the champion of America's Got Talent, Extreme. What do you guys think of Alfredo and the Cage Riders? How about Deadly Games? Let me know in the comments down below. While you're still on YouTube, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Follow Talent Recap on all social media platforms and check out our website, talentrecap.com. If you guys want to follow me, I'm at Corey Caesar on Instagram, and now you know what's hot. Hey, what are you doing tonight? Well, I think you should hit the subscribe button down below and then we can talk.